One of the game's most ferocious forwards. Well, it's gone from a villain to hero, from hero to villain. Who earned a place in state of origin folklore with the try and debut in the 2001 series. Inside the Broncos' base, an illustration of Carl Webb's toughness still holding the club's bench press record, an enduring legacy he leaves behind. Well, it's an extremely sad day uh, for, uh, for the Webb family and, uh, and rugby league uh, as well. Webb played 187 games for the Broncos, Cowboys and Eels, but faced his biggest challenge four years ago when diagnosed with motor neurone disease. So inspiring to see the way he has reacted to it because he just, it's not, it's not about him, it's about what he can do for others. Setting up the Carl Webb Foundation, he raised thousands of dollars to support fellow MND sufferers, all while waging his own private battle. It's not just me experiencing this, it's, it's also the family and loved ones. So, yeah, extremely proud of just how people have been. The father of four died at his Dolby home after a fall last night. Tributes led by Broncos coach Kevin Walters. Every time he walked into our place, you felt the respect and admiration from so many. Former teammate Ben Eichen adding, I found it truly remarkable that a guy who made a living out of being so powerful and explosive could handle with such grace the debilitating effects of MND. There'll forever be a permanent reminder of the impact Carl Webb had on the game of rugby league with his name and state of origin number emblazoned on the forecourt here at Suncorp Stadium, the scene of his greatest moments on field. And a fitting location to honour his memory. The Broncos and Cowboys will dedicate their round four clash next year to Webb and use the match to raise funds for his charity. I had the opportunity to go in and visit Carl uh, a couple of times and the thing was, um, you know, exactly what we expected from him. He said, uh, I'm not going to uh, uh, give in, I'm just going to fight it all the way. And he said, uh, and if I pass away too soon, I'm going to see even less matches where Queensland beat New South Wales. Carl Webb was 42. Adam Jackson, Nine News.